What's going on guys, G-Harp here. Crazy news this week, we're finally starting to learn some stuff about the Master Chief Collection. They released a lot of information on IGN. I'm thinking that they probably partnered with that 343 that is to release some information um, on their site. A lot of developers do this. They get some deals along with some of the huge websites or YouTube personalities or something like that to get their content out. IGN has put out a lot this week. Um, go check it out on their website. Go check it out on teambeyond.net. Um, they got all the information there. As always, they do an awesome job collecting everything, putting it all together. Now... The thing I want to talk about today, though, is they finally released the playlists that are going to ship with the Master Chief Collection. This is huge news. This is kind of gives us an idea of where their minds are, what they're looking at, and what we can expect as soon as the game ships. Now, it's very, very important to ship with good game types and with good playlists to keep the population involved, to keep it, to keep everybody motivated to keep playing. They even the past couple times hasn't been a really good job. We really didn't have a have a really good hardcore playlist or a competitive playlist when Halo 4 dropped. Um, Halo 3 really didn't either, but, you know, we, we kind of eventually pushed that way. But it's nice to see that we're going to get that. I'm going to go over what they released for the uh, game types here, give you guys a little sneak peek and everything. They released everything that they're going to put out. Um, the first one that they put out is going to be Team Halo 2 Anniversary 4v4. This is going to be your Halo 2 Anniversary maps. The six maps that they are released. Um, this is going to be your Team Slayer, regular, um, and objective game types. On the remastered maps. It's going to be all that kind of stuff. Um, the next one we're going to have is Halo 2 Anniversary Rumble. Um, you're going to be on the remastered maps again. You can go in alone. Um... It's kind of just like a regular FFA game type. Nothing too crazy there. Next, we have the Halo 2 Anniversary Social 5v5. So this is a nice social game type. Bring your friends in for the new uh, anniversary maps. Let them play along. Always good to have some social game types. It's kind of something we were missing the last couple Halos. Everything was kind of social. Nice to see that they're thinking about just including social playlists in this one. Then we have the Classic Team Slayer playlist. The most played playlist of all time. Um, especially in Halo 3, um, it was a huge, huge playlist. Probably, probably, yeah, Halo 2 as well. It's always the most played. It's the most common game type you're going to find in Halo. It is the quintessential Halo uh, game type. Then we have our big team battle. That's still the 8v8. And uh, you're going to get this for every single match. Same thing with the 4v4 I just mentioned. Every single Halo is going to be involved. That's the cool thing about the Master Chief Collection. You can play Halo CE, 2, 3, 4. They're all going to be included under one playlist. You're going to be able to veto for ones you want. So you could get a, a match of Halo CE at one time. The next thing you could get one in Halo 4. So on and so forth. That's really, really awesome. Um, and then they're, they start to do, uh, for their next playlist, just the individual games themselves. Um, they're doing 4v4 for Combat CE. They're going to do uh, 4v4 for Halo 2, Halo 3, and Halo 4. Um, now, instead for Halo 4, they're going to do a 5v5. Halo 4 is kind of weird that you, you kind of wanted more of a 4v5. Um, you know, it, or 5v5. It, it just wasn't as good. I It's just not that good of a game at all, in my opinion. But 5v5 works better on it. Um, and for all these playlists, you're going to get objective game types you know, and Team Slayer together. It's just an aggregated playlist for the, the individual games themselves. And this is actually the first time that we're going to see online multiplayer for Halo CE. Highly excited about that. I know that there's some kids out there that are ridiculously good at this game. They really never stop playing. So that should be interesting um, and, and fun to try to test your skills. You know, some of, a lot of us didn't have Xbox Connect when the, when the uh, Halo Combat Evolved was out. Um, so Halo 1 is going to be awesome online. I can't wait. 60 frames per second. It's going to be crazy to watch. Um, there's going to be some awesome stuff in that. The next one I'm really glad to see um, is Team Hardcore. Now, if you weren't around for Halo 2, Team Hardcore was the name of the playlist that all of the competitive games were played in. You had your MLG style games in that playlist. Very, very fun. Extremely competitive. Very, very hard. Um, but it really got you better at the game. You know, if you got to a 40, 41, 42 rank in Team Hardcore, you were pretty good. That is a solid, solid rank. 
I don't know how exactly they're going to do the ranking yet. They really haven't talked about it. But that was a nice benchmark for the way of how good you were, you know, how well you played with your team, all that kind of stuff. I'm excited to see that back. And that's going to be Halo 2 and Halo 3. Just those um, for 4v4s on that one. Um, Battle Rifle will be your starting weapon, as it should be. Um, so that is going to be very, very exciting. Nice aggregate of two of the best competitive Halos. They're keeping CE out, because I think, because they, they really didn't play 4v4 competitively. Uh, they played more 2v2-ish. They're keeping that out, though, which is completely fine with me. Halo 2, Halo 3, very, very fun competitive play. Should be really, really awesome. And then they have one for Halo Esports 4v4. They really don't say much about this, but this is going to be the playlist where all of your esports games are going to be. It's the official supported 343 playlist for competitive esports in Halo. I'm excited to see what comes of this playlist. It's really nice to see them actually put one out that they endorse that they're trying to build instead of just following MLG's lead or AGL and Halo 4's case, I guess, is lead, you know. I like to see the developer support. I'm very, very excited about that. Very nice to see. And they also have a rotational playlist. Um, it's SWAT. Uh, you're going to get your Halo 2, Halo 3, Halo 4, Halo 2 Anniversary all bundled up into one. Um, it's the SWAT game types you know and love. That should be fun for a lot of people. I know that's a very, very highly played playlist in pretty much every Halo. Um, but yeah, those are the starting playlists, guys. I'm excited. I really like them. Um, I think it's a nice diversity. Um, I'm surprised Team Snipers isn't in there, but I think that'll probably be in there at some point. Um, you know, they kind of wrap Team Objective up into the 4v4s, which is completely fine with me as well. I really like the way they're implementing everything. Two competitive playlists I'm extremely excited about. It should just be interesting to see what game takes the lead, you know, has the most amount of players. If I had to guess, I'd probably say Halo 3, but... You never know. Um, it's going to be really, really interesting to see how the community reacts to being able to play every game at the same time for once. You know, I, I can't wait. Get excited, guys. November 11th. Mark it down. Going to be incredible. But there's a lot of other news. I'm going to go over some of it tomorrow um, or the next day. Whenever I get a new video up, I'm going to go over some of the other stuff because there's a lot of news that was dumped out this week. But thanks for watching, guys. If you want to play with me, I'm going to thinking about doing some community customs at GBZ. I'll link it in the description. Add me up. We'll play. Try to help you guys out if you need anything. But as always, guys, subscribe. Like my stuff if you like me. Dislike it if you don't. Thanks for watching. Take her easy.